lesson is complete without a real world example, uh, which is something that I will uh, do daily as we go forward to get you thinking outside of mathematics is just mathematics. Well, Isabel and her friends making ribbons to give uh, to other campers at their day camp on Flag Day. They have a roll of 20 foot of ribbon, should I say 20 feet of ribbon. And the question is, uh, how many Flag Day ribbons can they make if each ribbon is four inches long? Okay, so thinking, we must first think in terms of inches instead of feet. And since um, four inches equal four over 12, because one feet is uh, 12 inches, uh, we can look at four over 12, or actually one third, because if you divide four into one and four into 12, you get one third foot. And then we will divide 20 by one third. So let's just go ahead and set it up and see what it will look like. We will have 20 and 20 is going to be divided by 1 over 3. So this is a little different than what we were doing. We are now dividing a whole number by a fraction, but still same concept. We must make sure that uh, we take 20 and write it as an improper fraction by putting uh, 20 over 1. So here we will have 20 over 1 divided by 1 over 3. Now, again, we're dividing by 1 over 3, which means we must what? Multiply okay, by the reciprocal uh, multiplicative inverse. So that would be 3 over 1. And, of course, numerator times numerator is 60. 3 times 20 and 1, and then we can reduce that improper fraction. To 60. Pretty simple, huh? So we can conclude by saying Isabel and her friend can make 60 flag day ribbons to apply. Okay? Keep that in mind looking at these real world problems and um, just simply pull out what you need, apply, and do the work.